Hey guys, welcome to the Long Class channel. My name is Simi and I'm currently a third year engineering student. Uh, today we'll be going over some commonly asked math questions at both the high school and university level. If you need some additional homework help or tutoring, please check out the links in the description below. Okay, uh, let's get started. All right, so the first question that we have today is asking how to rewrite uh, 1.05 with the 0 0.05 repeating as an equivalent fraction of integers. So first we have x is equal to 1.05 and they said that this 0 0.05 is repeating so usually they write it with the notation of a bar or line above the repeating decimals. Um, and our goal here is to convert this into a fraction of integers. So the first thing that we can do is multiply this um, by 100. So multiplying both sides by 100, we have 100x uh, is equal to 105.05 since, um, well, the 1.05. Um, 1 with the point uh, zero five repeating is uh, kind of like this, you know, in the long form. So when you move the decimal twice to multiply by a hundred, you still have the repeating, the repeating decimal at the end. So it's still point zero five repeating. Um, okay, and then now that we have this um, statement, what we can do is subtract the um, original original equation for x here, okay? So we're subtracting uh, x equals to 1.05 repeating so that we can get rid of this um, repeating decimal here because every single one, like I said before, um, this is what it looks like when it's expanded. Every single one of those decimals will line up and um, cancel each other out, okay? Um, so when we subtract the whole equation from the previous one here, we get 99x is equal to um, 104, right? Um, and then all we have to do is rearrange. We have 104 divided by 99, um, just by dividing both sides by 99, and that is your integer, okay? Um, those are two whole numbers for integers, and you can't um, reduce this fraction any further, so that is the answer to this question. All right, so they have the same solution here. And I'm just going to write correct. Oops, good work. And we can go to the next question. Oh. 